guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl Roxy and we are definitely doing a ponytail today so we're gonna do a cute little uh, top knot bun with two side bangs I've been seeing a lot of girls doing you know the the double side bang what do you call it the two-sided bangs I don't know and I find that they're so cute like I absolutely love them so I want to you know try that today show you guys how I do it um, for my ponytail I'm gonna use braiding hair so I'm using expressions to do like a top nut a top nut bun for the bang I'm gonna be using 10 uh, yeah I think it's 10 inches of hair yeah I'm gonna be using some 10 inch hair that I have left over from the Empire brand in the color 1B so I've used this here before most likely to do like a bang or you know maybe a quick weave anyways I have leftover so I'm going to use a couple tracks in order to do my bangs so if you guys want to see how I get things done keep on watching so I'm just brushing out the braiding here first so that the ends aren't so blunt because I want it to wrap nicely especially at the end so I'm just giving it like a quick brush out and this is probably like, I don't know, like a fifth of the expression pack of hair. I'm going to stick my hair up on a ponytail. I normally like to use edge control, but today I'm going to be using regular black gel. Alright, so I'm going to start off by parting out the bang. So it's going to be a middle part. So I'm going to part it out in like a triangular shape and then I'm going to do the same thing to the next side. Okay, so as you guys know, I like to slick up my hair into a ponytail first while it's dry, and then I add the gel on the outside. I'm gonna wrap my top knot bun while this is drying. I normally put something around it to tie, but I can't find anything right now. And my head tie is like way too big. It's gonna block my ponytail. So now I'm just gonna take the pack of hair and I use the scrunchie to make an anchor so that I can attach it to my bun, of course. So I'm just gonna Wrap it around my bun as if I was just tying a ponytail. Okay, so I have two sides here. I'm just gonna wrap it and twist it around in one direction. Now I'm just going to twist and wrap the ponytail 
in the same direction you could do it in the opposite direction but I think it's gonna look better if I twist it in the same direction Okay, so my bun is in place. That was really easy. I feel like that was under under 60 seconds or maybe about 60 seconds. But the point is, like this is super easy. And I could have made the bun bigger, like in size, and you just do that by adding or using more braiding here. So now I'm gonna start out my bang. I'm just gonna part down the middle. I'm gonna take the flat iron and just straighten it out a bit because it's kind of cranky. It's kind of crimply and also I need a relaxer. Okay, so I just smoothed out both sides. I'm going to start on one side and add tracks. So I'm going to add about two tracks on each side. I'm just going to take this side out the way. So this is it. This is the finished look. I think this is super cute. I feel a little bit younger than my age. You know, it's giving me like a youthful vibe. Very simple. Slick my hair up in a bun, use some braiding hair for a top knot, and I use 10 inches of hair to, you know, literally two tracks on each side and they're about this long. My hair blends perfectly with the with the weave. Yeah, it's just it's just really cute and simple it kind of feels like an effortless look but yeah if you guys like this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up comment below if you have any comments or questions and if you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe for more videos and I'll see you guys in my next one bye